Hi everybody and welcome back to my vlog. My name is Sue and I'm from OML Embroidery and what is a vlog? It's a video blog where I get to say whatever I want and we'll just have a chat about embroidery or things that can help with embroidery. Today I want to talk about my awesome fabric. A lot of people are asking questions. Where do you get that fabric? What is it? The whole bit. So I'm going to explain it to you guys because it's kind of a new discovery for me. I would just go to the fabric store and just buy some fabric and cut off what I need and that sort of thing. And then I discovered pre-cuts. I actually discovered Craftsy. That's where I've gotten all my pre-cuts because I can't really buy them around here. And if I can, they are silly expensive. So what's a pre-cut? They are pre-cut into different sizes. Now, this is a charm square. So a charm square is five by five. And when you buy it in a pack, so this, I went with the Halloween design because I really like the Halloween fabric. When you buy it in a charm square pack, you get two or three pieces of every fabric. Now this one wasn't too expensive. I think it was like $7 for all of this. Now of course you can only use it for you know small things and whatnot. I keep the bigger pieces. That one that I just put aside was something that I used up and it's like you know okay and actually I have a couple more to add in there. I pulled them out for something. But it's really nice because you get the whole line which I find fantastic. Now if a charm square is too small move over to a layer cake. This is a layer cake. Now, it happens to be for this one, I purchased a layer cake and the charm squares. They're exactly the same fabric and from the same, you know, um, designer. And I thought it was really neat. So then I had small and then I have bigger. So layer cakes, I have no idea why it's called that. I guess it's so much fun. It's cake. I have no idea. Layer cakes are 10 by 10. So double the size, double the size of a charm square. So that's how it looks. So double the size. And again, you get two or three of every single fabric in that line. So this is the Halloween line. And two or three of everything, which is really neat. And it's it's a really great size for embroidery because when I'm doing quilt squares or different things like that, they're usually eight by eight is the size that I go to. So when I'm putting my base fabric down, I don't have to cut anything because this is 10 by 10. That even gives you a nice seam allowance and it just saves me time. The other thing that's really neat is for fabric coordination. It's super easy to coordinate fabric that is already coordinated. All the colors in it match because look, for example, this polka dot has all the colors of this in it and all the colors of this in it. So you can see how well and how easily everything goes together. So I've learned a lot by buying these pre-cuts. I've learned a lot about matching and not matching. Now on Craftsy, you can also get fat quarter bundles and it depends on how many different fabrics are in the grouping. Um, I don't, I didn't get a Halloween one though, although I should have, I think, cause I'm enjoying the Halloween fabric so much. This one is, called out for happiness which is really cool so it just and a fat quarter is 18 by 22 or 18 by 24 um not so much on fabric i'm learning though um and look it comes with bigger pieces of everything so you can pick a line you can buy it by the yard you can buy it by the fat quarter you can buy it by half the yard you can buy it by leg layer cake pre-cut and of course, back to the fun charm squares. So that's quite a few ways to buy. And again, with this one, look at how well the colors go. They're gorgeous. They match, they go with each other. The green has some yellow in it. And for this one, it's graduated coloring. So I think it's even better. So this is how I like to buy stuff. I'm, I'm thinking, look, isn't that pretty? I'm thinking that's really fun. So. Here's one I got that we're gonna have a look at. We're gonna open it actually. We're gonna open it and have a look. This is how you get it, by the way, from Craftsy. It's backed with cardboard. It's got pretty ribbon around it. There's stickers 
and uh, safe and lovely and covered in plastic. So let's carefully cut the plastic so we don't make a mess. They're nice uh, sealed, so nothing is going to happen to them, that's for sure. And let's pull this off. Ooh, it's looking good. Put the garbage aside. And I, I think the tag, it almost feels like it's a present every time <laughs> that you get it just for the joy of it. That's what this one's called. So let's be bad and just cut the ribbon. I love the packaging. It's professional. It's wonderful and available in Canada, by the way. So this obviously is a layer cake. It fits over my Halloween just perfectly. Let's look at some of the prints that you get. Okay, that is lovely which matches that. Oh, I love the colors. Oh, I love that color too. It's so bright. And there's a couple of, that's amazing. That's amazing. And snowflakes. And then that's a pretty blue with letters. Now the same snowflakes back there, but in gray, which is really cool how to do it. Now that's a, a gray version of the first one that we saw. So that's kind of a neat way to match it up. And this one is different again, but the same. See how easy it is to coordinate your fabrics? I, I think it's marvelous. <gasps> now we have it in like a mustard yellow, the snowflakes. And orange, those are like hedgehogs or something, which I think is cool. Oh, the lettering that was turquoise, now it's a different color. Oh, that's amazing. Sorry, my dogs. That's a different one too. My dogs are barking. And then top burgundy. So how many did we get of the snowflakes? It makes it so easy to coordinate all your fabrics. And if you buy, say, this one and maybe a yard or two of the ones that you like best, it's a lot to work with. I mean, look how much fabric is there. It's a lot to work with. I'm finding with appliques, it makes everything really nice, especially if you have, you know, the small charm squares that are already coordinating to put on different things. I'm just finding it so much fun. Now, I love a couple of these ones, and I think it would be really neat to have the blue one, and then there was a brighter one in orange. You could do a lot of fun stuff with that. I, I think it's really neat how they're coordinated and how they go. This is gonna be fun for making little quilts and little different things. So anyways, I have found adding you know, pre-cut fabric has kicked everything up a notch because I really do have beautiful work. Um, I know I've been doing a lot of Halloween stuff, but I think it's turning out awesome and it makes me happy and I have a ton of it. So hopefully that'll answer some questions about what it is that I'm talking about. Um, it's a time saver. It makes everything beautiful and it's super easy to do. And you know what? Let's face it. Storage is brilliant. You only have to store that much. I put them on a bookshelf and I put dividers in between of course, the Halloween one has been out for a little while, but okay, that's fine. Uh, it's easier to store. You can store it flat. Nothing is wrinkled. You don't have to fold or do anything like that. I found it really enjoyable. So check out pre-cuts for your embroidery and see if you guys like them. I find it's so much fun having different selections. I don't know about where you are, but where I am, fabric is normally, even for just cotton quilting fabric, is normally $15 a yard at least. So it's quite pricey. So this has been a savior to me because I can have a little bit of everything. And I really like that. So hopefully where you are, fabric is cheaper, but not where I am. Maybe if I was in a bigger city or something, I don't know. So enjoy. Get yourself some happy mail from Craftsy.com or any other quilt shop that offers pre-cuts for you, all coordinated and a whole line. And uh, enjoy making. It's so much more fun to make when you have a lot of ideas. It's inspirational. I keep flipping through it and it gives me ideas. So anyways, thanks for joining me on my uh, vlog, and I'll vlog again next week and we'll do something different. Thanks everyone, don't forget to like and subscribe. There's a lot of classes, we have challenges, and there's a lot of creative kiwi stitching going on. So thanks everyone, and I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye.